so guys how are you doing it's obvious we named something wrong um, what I mean is here what, what we are calling the ref categories is actually supposed to be the ref levels and vice versa which means I will, I will change it now I'll have to come to the migrations to switch it up um, it's good that you see me doing it instead of me going to reverse um, do it behind you you see me doing it so if you ever make a mistake you know how to fix it so we're going to go to ref levels the idea is that the ref level is supposed to be the ref category and vice versa so I'll go to ref category um, copy everything that is there and um, save take it to ref level paste now this unique kind of doesn't make sense the name being unique in the sense that it only needs to be unique for a particular user so if user one come logs into our platform and um, names something Facebook user two should be able to log into their account and feel free to name it Facebook and um, it shouldn't clash so that's why I'm gonna remove this um, and the same thing with this I'm gonna remove that all right so but rules should stay because there can only be um, three or four rules uh, throughout the whole platform okay so I think we're done so we just moved this to which means we are going to run migrations again but to make it easier for me I'm going to go to app go to controllers and delete uh, both of them ref level and ref controller oops I'm sorry I just messed up something I'm gonna close this I just messed up so here ref category delete move to recycle bin ref level delete move to recycle bin so I'm going to try and delete it again here uh, ref level in the models uh, just note that you can actually do it without deleting uh, but the only thing is that while you're running uh, the whole stuff again it's going to start asking you a lot of questions should it replace the file should it replace the file and I don't want it so go to resources go to views and delete ref levels delete ref categories the whole folder um, now my system is hanging all right so ref category folder delete okay so once we delete it we're good everything makes sense now so we're gonna run migrations again but what you have to understand is that um, if you run migration as usual it's going to wipe out or wipe clean everything here all right even the user will have to create a new user again um, so we'll go to migration click the up arrow key and um, sorry php artisan make colon migration space oh sorry php artisan migrate and then colon refresh that's what we need hit enter so that kind of reboots our entire application good now the next best thing we're gonna do is to actually create uh, for the tool so we press up arrow key and we're here so we'll create um, we we'll generate files for ref category hit enter after that we we'll generate for ref level so it's generated it didn't ask us ask us any question because we already deleted the files like I said if you don't delete the files it will keep asking you if it should replace each of the files all right, so we good. Uh, let's do that for ref level. Up, up, up. Ref level. That's ref level. Hit enter, and um, that's done. All right. So we now have. If we go to resources, we go to views. We now see we have to click this um, reload. Resources views. You see, ref levels and ref categories have been recreated. So uh, we have now uh, cleaned up our mess. See you in the next video.